The Rocketeer is a fictional superhero appearing in American comic books originally published by Pacific Comics. Created by writer, artist Dave Stevens, the character first appeared in 1982 and is a homage to the Saturday matinee serial heroes from the 1930s through the 1950s. The Rocketeer's secret identity is Cliff Secord, a stunt pilot who discovers a mysterious jetpack that allows him to fly. His adventures are set in Los Angeles and New York in 1938, and Stevens gave them a retro, nostalgic feel influenced by the King of the Rocket Men and Commando Cody movie serials both from Republic Pictures, and pin-up diva Betty Page. The character was adapted into the 1991 Walt Disney Pictures film The Rocketeer by director Joe Johnston. Topic. Premise. In 1938 Los Angeles, Cliff Secord, a local racing pilot and barnstormer, discovers a rocket pack hidden by two gangsters fleeing the police. When he decides to take it for a spin, his life is turned upside down, in more ways than one. Topic. Publication history The Rocketeer's first adventure appeared in 1982 as a backup feature in issues number 2 and number 3 of Mike Grell's Starslayer series from Pacific Comics. Two more installments appeared in Pacific's showcase comic Pacific Presents No. 1 and 2. The fourth chapter ended in a cliffhanger that was later concluded in a special Rocketeer issue released by Eclipse Comics. The complete story was then collected by Eclipse in a single volume titled The Rocketeer ISBN 1-56060-088-8. It was published in three versions, a trade paperback edition, a trade hardcover, and a signed, limited edition hardcover. Noted fantasy author Harlan Ellison, a fan of The Rocketeer and also an acquaintance of Dave Stevens, wrote the introduction to the collection. Both Dave Stevens and Harlan Ellison signed the limited edition on a specially bound in bookplate. The story was continued in The Rocketeer Adventure magazine. Two issues were published by Comico Comics in 1988 and 1989. The third installment was not published until 1995, six years later by Dark Horse Comics. All three issues were then collected by Dark Horse into a glossy trade paperback titled The Rocketeer, Cliff's New York Adventure ISBN 1-56971-092-9 that quickly went out of print. In 1991 comics artist Russ Heath illustrated the graphic novel The Rocketeer, the official movie adaptation, based on Walt Disney's 1991 feature film The Rocketeer. On February 28, 2009, IDW Publishing announced a hardcover collecting the entire series for the first time, intended to be published in October 2009. Dave Stevens' The Rocketeer, The Complete Adventures contained new coloring by Laura Martin, who had been chosen by Dave Stevens prior to his death. The book appeared in December, two months later than announced, in two versions, a standard trade hardcover edition with full-color dust jacket and a second, more lavish, deluxe edition ISBN 978-1600105371, limited to 3,000 hardcover copies. The deluxe edition used different Stevens artwork for its dust jacket and was issued in an illustrated, all-color slipcase, it also had full-color illustrated endpapers. While the deluxe contains the same Rocketeer comics reprints as the trade edition, it adds more than 130 pages of previously uncollected Rocketeer material, sketches, preliminaries, character designs, script pages, photographs, and original art pages, with commentaries by Dave Stevens and several peers who occasionally assisted him on the Rocketeer. The deluxe edition sold out almost immediately upon publication, but IDW announced a second printing. In May 2011 IDW debuted the first issue of Rocketeer Adventures. Issue number one featured work from John Cassidy, Mike Allred, Kurt Busiek, and Michael Kaluta, plus pin-ups by Mike Magnola, Dave Stewart, and Jim Silk. 
The four 2011 issues offered regular and variant cover designs by both Alex Ross and Dave Stevens. Various black and white retailer incentive variants were also published in limited press runs. Several additional variant issues by Jet Pack Comics, featuring recolored Dave Stevens artwork, were also published in limited press runs. To celebrate the launch of this all-new Rocketeer series, IDW's 100 Penny Press also simultaneously released a $1 reissue of the original The Rocketeer No. 1 by Dave Stevens, fully remastered and recolored by Eisner winner Laura Martin. The first four Rocketeer Adventures issues were then collected in 2011 into a hardcover graphic novel, followed by second hardcover graphic novel in 2012 that collected the next four issues. A color Rocketeer title logo was used on the regular retail copies of the graphic novel, plus one additional retailer incentive hardcover without a title logo printed on its dust cover. Both versions were offered with the same Alex Ross's color artwork. The two volumes were collected in an oversized deluxe edition in 2017. A four-issue miniseries by IDW, Rocketeer, Cargo of Doom, debuted in 2012. Each issue offered a regular retail cover design and one alternate retailer incentive cover. In addition publisher Jet Pack Comics issued several additional retailer incentive variants with Dave Stevens' recolored artwork reprinted on their covers. The miniseries was then collected as two variant graphic novel hardcovers, one offered with a regular dust jacket, the other without. A four-issue IDW miniseries, Rocketeer, Hollywood Horror, debuted in late February 2013. As with the previous series, each issue offered a regular retail cover design and one retailer incentive alternate cover. The miniseries was then collected as two variant hardcover graphic novel editions, one with a regular style dust jacket, the other without. A fifth IDW miniseries, Rocketeer and the Spirit, Pulp Friction, debuted in mid-2013, as another limited four-issue miniseries. As with the two previous Rocketeer miniseries, each issue offered a regular retail cover design and one retailer incentive alternate cover. A special San Diego Comic Con International promotional variant issue number no. one, with a black and white wraparound cover, was offered only at the 2013 convention. The miniseries was then collected as a hardcover graphic novel. In September, 2014, IDW issued The Rocketeer, Jet Pack Adventures, a prose anthology of ten short stories written by authors including Yvonne Navarro, Don Webb, Gregory Frost, Nancy Holder, Nancy A. Collins. Set between 1939 and 1946, the stories feature appearances by such historical figures as Howard Hughes, Hedy Lamarr, Tarzan's Johnny Weismuller, and writer Zane Gray. A sixth IDW Rocketeer miniseries, Rocketeer, at War, debuted in December 2015. <laughs> Topic. Background Topic. Illusions The Rocketeer makes a great number of references to pop culture from the 1930s to the 1950s. The first storyline, The Rocketeer, features characters from the Doc Savage Pulp series, though Stevens takes care not to refer to any of the characters, including Doc Savage himself, by name, so as not to violate copyright and incur a licensing fee for use of the characters. Cliff's New York Adventure similarly features unnamed characters from the Shadow Pulp magazine series, including the Shadow's alter ego, Lamont Cranston. Besides pulp characters, actors of the 1940s and 1950s have also visually inspired two characters, Lothar, the villain in Cliff's New York Adventure is based on the likeness of acromegalic horror movie star Rondo Hatton, and Cliff Secord's girlfriend Betty is modeled after Queen of Pinups, Betty Page, a Rocket Man character, with a near-identical rocket backpack and similar uniform, appeared in four Republic Pictures movie serials from 1949 through 1953. 
The fourth serial, originally conceived as a syndicated Republic TV series, was first released under contractual obligation to movie houses as a regular multi chapter theatrical serial. Two years later, it was recut with new footage and additional music added and finally syndicated on NBC television stations as 12 25 minute episodes. The four Republic Rocket Man serials were King of the Rocket Men 1949, Radar Men from the Moon 1952, Zombies of the Stratosphere 1952, and Commando Cody, Sky Marshal of the Universe serial 1953, TV series 1955. Topic: In other media Film Disney produced The Rocketeer in 1991, directed by Joe Johnston, and starring Billy Campbell, Jennifer Connelly, Alan Arkin, Timothy Dalton, Paul Sorvino and Tiny Ron Taylor. The film was released on June 21, 1991 and received generally favorable reviews from critics, although plans for Rocketeer sequels were abandoned after a poor box office performance. Rocketeer creator Dave Stevens appears in a cameo as a German test pilot killed during the test of a Nazi rocket backpack. As of 2017, efforts have been made by Disney toward doing a remake. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Television. A television series for Disney Junior is being developed for fall 2019. The series focuses on a young girl named Kit who receives a rocket-powered jet pack for her birthday. Topic. Video games The first officially licensed Rocketeer game was released for the Nintendo Entertainment System on May 1991. It is a side-scrolling action game published and developed by Bandai, and followed the plot of the movie. Developer Novologic released a licensed PC game in December 1991 which was published by Disney Software. Novologic went on to port the game to the Super NES in May 1992 with IGS as the publisher. Both versions are a collection of minigames based on the film. Homages <laughs> <laughs> Topic. Comics The character Gabe from the Penny Arcade webcomic confuses the term racketeering with rocketeering as both a satirical jab at a recent event and a tribute to the rocketeer character. Eric Canet's cover for Iron Man, Enter the Mandarin No. 1 pays homage to the rocketeer film's Art Deco-style theatrical poster. The webcomic Basic Instructions occasionally features the character. Rocket Hat, who battles the Moon Men, a clear reference to Republic Pictures' original Rocket Man and Commando Cody movie serials that inspired Dave Stevens in creating the Rocketeer. Topic: <laughs> Songs. The song Rocketeer by Foxy Shazam is an homage to the film. Topic. Television In The Amazing World of Gumball's Season 5 episode, The Boredom, Rocketeer's Jet Pack can be seen in the dumpster. Topic. Video games Rocket Ranger 1988 a Rocketeer-inspired character, named Brocketeer, is featured as a playable character in the game Broforce. Topic. Reception IGN listed the Rocketeer as the 76th greatest comic book character, stating that the Rocketeer taps into that popular desire to fly. IGN also stated the Rocketeer saga remains a compelling one.